guys welcome back to my channel how are you all doing did you see the picture that popped up that's what we are about to do today we're going to do oat breakfast smoothie i'm using two dates one banana and three spoons of oats so first of all we're going to start by measuring three spoons of oats into a bowl and we're going to soak it for five to ten minutes so you just put the oats into a bowl and put your date into it and let it soak for five to 10 minutes in order for it to to dissolve and get ready to be blend in the blender that's the logic behind it so that it will soak up the water and it will be easy blend and you can digest easily as well so i'm just putting in the two dates if you want you can put cashew nut if you want as a natural source of milk or any form of protein you want to add to it because we're not using milk or sugar in this smoothie and i trust me it was so yummy that even you yourself you will know that there's no need for any syrup sugar or milk it turned out to be perfect so i put that aside and i took a, sp a spoon of granite this is roasted granite i'm just going to dice it like this and put it aside for garnishing and we're not going to use it now yet i just want to push it aside to garnish the top of the smoothie and have that little crunchy feel when i'm drinking my smoothie so that's why you just take your time to do this grind it use a sharp knife and mind your fingers if you have a, a dry blender that you want to scatter blend it rough blend it fine that's that will work good too but i feel this is an easy way to go and you will see the texture you want to get out of it so and it will make you you know feel like it's the chef ranzi in you working in the kitchen it just makes me feel so chefy when i'm using the knife to cut my garlic or my gran or my granite like this so that's why i decided to do it that way and it's fun so we'll keep that aside for now and now we're ready to blend our smoothie so the smoothie is been soaked for five minutes already so i'm putting it now into the blender and after adding that into the blender i'll put in my my granite as well that's about three tablespoons of granite it depends on how much you want to use i like granite a lot so that's why i use two spoons three spoons and that's our banana peeled and ready to go and the next thing i added was flaxseed you guys know i've been telling you guys amazing things flaxseed does to your body so that cinnamon have a teaspoon of cinnamon and one big spoon of flaxseed and i put everything into the blender and that is our smoothie ready to go you know flaxseed give you that natural fiber helps losing your bowels and helps you to maintain your weight as well is a good source of protein and fiber i've always talked about how amazing flaxseed is if you haven't watched most of my video on flaxseed go to my channel check it out there's so many things you could do with flaxseed which i'm still exploring so after i put everything into the blender and that's what I'm doing. have to give it an extra spin because I didn't want to be feeling <laughs> honey sugar or anything any sweet nine to it so that's our smoothie ready and ready to go that's the date coming out in long stay it wasn't well blended but i enjoyed it like that anyway so that's our smoothie ready and that's the granite i blended earlier just garnishing it thank you for watching try this out and let me know in the comment section below if you enjoy it or not i sure did enjoy it thank you for watching if you haven't subscribed feel free to subscribe and join the family let me know if you try that. I'm loving, loving this right now. Thank you guys. God bless you all. Have a blessed day.